This disk at the centre of the machine is one of the data bus's disks. A single disk represents one single bit of information. It can be either true or false. The data bus must be able to communicate with several other modules. The arithmetic and logic unit, the input and output, the memory, the program counter, and of course, the control unit. A disk belonging to such a module, just like the data bus's disk, can be either true or false. For the data bus to read information from any other module, a mechanism is needed and a source of power. Once the mechanism is set in motion, the information is copied from one disk to the other.